Hey guys, welcome back to YouTube once again for round two. I got a top and die yet to show you today. I got it in about the same time I'm just uploading a um, bearing press right now. The video I got to do a metric standard top and die. I got my video camera in yesterday. I want to show you the other day. I just tested out real good and it works good today. I just got this in. My wife got it. Thanks, Lacey, for getting it for me. Out of her stimulus money. It ran me about it ran her about forty-two to forty-three dollars on eBay. It's a slide hammer come in through UPS ground. Yeah, I put the stuff in a little baggie right here because a little tiny bag that come with it was ripped. So I just did that. You know, for like the nuts, bolts, and my dip polar. Basically, with this lag bolt, you slide it into the hole here, screw it into this, and you can actually use it, screw it into this big one right here, and you can actually use that for a dip polar. And this here, this kit here I got is for bearings, hubs, oil seals, internal and external bearings, and stuff. This part here, you screw onto this, tighten the nut up against it, put this on your wheel for your hub, and slide hammer it off. These here, like this, you put them on this, here to have a three-way for your bearings, or gears, or whatever, and you got a two-way as well. You got three of those. You just have to use these nut bolts to fasten, just finger tighten is all. You know, you got your oil seal tools, different unit chair. Um, this kit was running about 40 bucks on eBay. Now, it about $43 or so. Close to 45 with tax. Um, it's very heavy. I mean, it's very heavy. It feels like a half-dead body or so lifting that. With this and this on it, that even makes it much heavier. You'd almost use it for a curl or like a barbell type deal weight. Um, do I like renting tools? Technically not. is because um, if the tool breaks, then you don't get your deposit back and you just lost a hundred bucks and you got a broken tool. So it's why it's best to do it yourself and it saves time and money taking them to the garage because you know garage are especially, especially dealerships they always are you know dealerships are the highest and then certain crooked garages out there replace stuff that don't need to be replaced that's another thing then you got the labor parts and everything involved it's best to do this and buy your stuff yourself but do I think it's a professional grade yes I do can you use it for a homeowner yes I do do you think it's cheap filling uh, no, it's not cheap filling. Do I think it's made super well and super nice and heavy duty? Yes, I do. But, and I want to thank you. I got 199 subscribers. I need one away from 200. Try to get my wife some, you know, because poor girl sitting with 11. Rick, my buddy from Ghost Police Paranormal Investigators, he has 36. I'm rocking 199, one away from 200. And I do have some more videos coming out tomorrow, this week, whatnot. You know, I got kind of busy and I ain't been on for a while, but I want to show you this slide hammer cat for bearings, internal, external type stuff, slide hammer for hubs, drive axles, you know, stuff like that. But like, subscribe, comment, ring that notification bell for more future videos like this. I'm going to try to upload this video when my bearing press gets done. I'm going to slide in the slide hammer video. And why it's uploading, then I'm going to do the uh, tap and dice set that I bought. Which was about 30 bucks. You got a standard and a metric piece. Metric and standard both. So, I'll talk to you in the next one here real shortly. And then after the tap and die gets done, I got a video camera yet to do. And then this week, I got... New DeWalt safety glasses coming in, defogged hype. I'm going to test, do a review on. I'll uh, give you my final thoughts on those. 
I got some wobble sockets coming in. I got another OBD2 tool coming in. It's really cool. It's paid about $160 for it. My wife got it for me on eBay to test every little thing in her vehicle. So when I do that test, I'll have my wife to film that day because I'll have to, you know, do the buttons and stuff. So sure I'll be available for that one video. But anyhow, like, subscribe, comment, thumbs it up. No haters, no trolls, or you could get blocked. Ring that notification bell, like I said, for more future videos. Thanks for the nearly 200 subscribers. I appreciate the love and support you guys are all giving me. Um, love y'all out there. See you real soon in the next one. Thanks. Bye.